All right, that's where we need to be, y'all. Duck 90. Yes, sir. Welcome, welcome to Proctor and Gamble, y'all. Yeah, we're still with the extras. We still with the extras. So we are at Proctor and Gamble for the fee, not for the free. Now, in case anybody wondering, we're over here for the fee, not for the free. Yeah. For the fee, not for the free. And it's raining, so. Yes, sir. We're here. Practo and gamble, baby. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. That's money. Every time you see that, that's money. Either way you looked at it, ladies and gentlemen, that is nothing but money. Anyways, I think, uh, you know, leave that there. Let me see here. Oh, yeah, we got that open. Yeah, we're good to go. Let's go ahead and back into back in the money. people they came out here already as soon as they saw me man as soon as they saw me boom they're taking a little cigarette break in the let me see let me see here bye yes sir they in there doing the little cigarette break and after that we on the money ah man Proctor and gamble for the fee not for the free mm -mm -mm. YouTube, what is going on? Oh, what is hey, it? been a while, man. Oh, yeah, yeah. We're still on the in the 2024. Uh, let me see if I can pull it up. Let me see. Can I pull it up right now? I'm trying to see if we can pull up how much we're averaging. Hold on. On the miles per gallon. Okay, hold on now. We're uh hold on now trip one boom okay on this trip we did 7.1 miles to the gallon because we were 43,000 pounds and if y'all notice hold on is this on you know i gotta make sure this is not on y'all okay good it's not on because i want to i was trying to make sure that the, the voice is not being picked through the headset 7.1 miles, we were 43,000 pounds net weight. Gross, gross, we were about 48, no, we were 78 something right around, 78,000 pounds or some change. Yeah, 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 yeah. Prior to this though, it was Pepper Mill Hamilton, day in, day out. Pepper Mill Hamilton, day in, day out. Right now it's Procter and Gamble. For the fee, not for the free. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Just remember that now. For the fee, not for the free. Oh, oh, oh. Something about this 2024s, y'all, it's like, I'm gonna show you. The refrigerator in Gen 6 is, is great, but it freezes stuff too much, and I messed it up. Obviously, that's on me because I wasn't able to figure out how to regulate it, right? But this 2024 s so what I do, I freeze the almonds. Yeah, the Cripple King freeze the almonds. Mmm. Got that coconut in the middle. Yeah. These 2024s, you can set them up just right. Just right. 
so you can get your almond joy correct wheel YouTube what's going on man I have not been the vehicle has been stuck for five minutes do you want to switch to on duty Yes, sir. And matter of fact, we're gonna switch to off do it. What be going on YouTube in YouTube universe? What what be going on in the YouTube world, man? I, I haven't been catching up. I have not been catching up on what's going on in the YouTube universe. I've been in the mud. I'm trying to get it out the mud again like we did when we got in trucking. I'm trying to get it out the mud again. The boy is, hey man, you see this? Yes. This right here is that jailhouse. Neck. Thick neck. Both shoulders. This is that jailhouse physique. We trying to get it again out the mud. <laughs> we trying to get it out the mud. We're trying to turn a penny and nickel into a dollar. You know what I'm saying? We're trying to get back in the trenches and make something happen, man. So we've been out here six weeks. We ain't really officially taking the home time yet. And actually, no six. So I got here. I got on the road on the 17th of July, right? So what's today's date? Today's the 27th of August. I came in the 17th. Today's the 27th. So 27th. You do the math, bro. You do the math, right? We actually been here over six weeks already. I gotta be honest. I was gonna go home on the 29th. But I already booked two loads on me already. And today is the 27th. So the 27th creep up on me and I didn't even realize it. But it's what you got to do when you want to get it back out the mud. You got to get back to that foundation. You got to get back in the trenches. You got to mix that cement up. You, you got you to gotta, you gotta get in there, man. You got to bam, bam. You got to bring it back together one nail at a time. You got to be out the man. You got to get it out the mud. Six weeks. Now, it ain't be that bad because I booked a few loads going through Texas. So, you know, I will slide through the crib. So, the queen bee, I got a little green. She's going to let me get in between a little bit and then slide out the next day. You know what I'm saying? I just did the 34 at the crib because I had gotten a load that was going to uh, Shreveport, Louisiana. Okay, so I put Louis, Louis, by the way, y'all keep an eye on that oil field now. Y'all keep an eye on that oil field. I told one of my boys that oil creep, field is creeping back up. It's creeping back up. It's not because we want to. It's because we have to. I don't want to get into politics, but I'm going to give you a free game. If you got some bread to invest, if you ain't got no oil field experience, start thinking about it. The three of the four, three of the top five companies we used to deal with when it comes to importing oil really don't want to F with America no more. Venezuela, we got Russia, that's two, that's the top five. And now Saudi Arabia is pretty much stabbing us and pimping us right now. So what Saudi Arabia is doing right now, they're buying oil from Russia because we put Russian in sanction. 
this the the, the, the buying oil from Russia for penny on the dollar, right? And they're turning around selling us that same oil for top dollar. Top dollar. I repeat, man. Bro, how can the trucker figure this out, but your politician cannot? We're not going to spend too much time on that. But the point is, Saudis are buying oil on the penny from Russia because Russia got to sell that stuff. They can't sell it to the number one consuming planet on planet Earth. The number one consuming country on planet Earth is the United States. We just take and we don't want to pr produce nothing. So with America out, Russia dump their prices and stuff. And Saudis like, you know what? We get effing with America. We're gonna buy up the dollar, take the same oil and sell it top dollar. Pepin is, man, hey man, I never thought a pimp would look, would wear no, no boxer underneath that big ass gown and six lemons and white tigers, man. Look, Saudis, they reach for a reason. They're pimping. No Vaseline with the United States. But anyway, they're about to be gone because they're going to join the BRICS. Y'all don't know nothing about that. I'm not, this is not an educational channel on that matter, okay? Just know America is going to be forced to drill. I don't matter if Democrat are in office. Y'all don't know when Republican in office, it's money time. It's drill time. <laughs> it's frat time. These damn tree hugging motherfuckers get in office. They screw the game up, but now they're gonna have to see ways of the Republican. Oh yeah, yeah, they're gonna have to think like a Republican, cause Saudi say F us, uh, Russia say F us, Venezuela say F us. Those are the three of the five most suppliers of crude oil to the United States. They not effing with us. By next year, it's gone for real, for real. This time, Russia and for, and for the Saudis is kind of effing with us because you know the pimp game is strong. We are we are Saudis number one hoe, bottom bitch. So you know you're gonna eff with us for a little bit, but next year it's gone because they you know they created a competitor tornado. Like I said, I, I ain't going too deep into that, but yeah. So fracking is coming back, oil fuel is coming back. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Why you sitting here watching this video? You ain't got no oil fuel experience. Now, now, now it's a good time. <laughs> you feel me? You know, now it's a good time to hop on that YouTube university. Go back to my old, old video. Learn how to use a vacuum truck. Get your ass to Midland, Odessa, Peso, or go to freaking North Dakota and get to the money. Because the oil field is creeping up. We just might go to the oil field. But if we do, we ain't going with the 2024. <laughs> nah, nah. Mm -mm. Just like I didn't do it with Genesis. We're not doing it with the 2024. If we go to the oil field, we're going to go with, with, well, with something that your favorite YouTube trucker got. Oil and Raglan. Or I'll just go. Give me 30%, bro. Give me, give me 30%. I'll make you a whole lot of money. Just give me 30%. Just make sure I get $3,000 a week. That's all I need. That's it. But until then, the dog skin is hot out here. I practice and gamble. For the fee. <laughs> Not for the free.